there. Like Anderson Silva when he was like 30 to 32. Mm. Woo! He's going. I remember that. Oh! Uh, longest reign. You would watch him. You just like put your hands to your head and go, geez. The first one I saw live was UFC 90. Uh, he fought Patrick Cote. Oh, that was an just, interesting one. Yeah, no, nah, but like for me, that fought first very round. very smart. But that first round, he used like probably seven different styles to just hit him. And then I keep saying he uses telekinesis on his knee. He just blew it out. But like Patrick had a fucked up knee going into that fight, I think. Already. It's yeah. hard, hard to tell, but yeah. it just seemed like it gave out. It was a good fight. It was a good yeah. fight. Okay, he just stood on it and just like, ah, yeah. fucked up. I think like, he went to like throw a front kick and it just buckled on him shit. and popped out. Yeah. No, but like that fight, that first round, the way he just handled him, I was like, that. Yeah. That's the guy. You know what? It it really did open up the recipe to giving Anderson trouble, though, because mm. the recipe to giving Anderson trouble, Talos Latis opened it up, and so Damian did Patrick Maya. Cote. No, but what, the real key was don't engage, mm. because if you chase Way after back. him, he's going to fuck you up. Like, think like Forrest Griffin, all these different people that came at him, uh, for sure Chris Lieben. Mm. And that was oh, the first one, 90 that seconds. That was the recipe for disaster. Yeah. I mean, I knew when I saw that fight on paper, I was like, oh. Oh, this is crazy. Like you got a guy who's like the most reckless, iron-chinned marauder in the UFC, and you're putting up a, him against a guy who's like a ninja. Mm. And this is going to be crazy. And this is a perfect fight. It was yeah. a perfect fight in terms of like you want to see like the effectiveness yeah. of like high-level timing, speed, and perfect technique. Like, woo! Yeah. No, and the way he did it as well was clean. I think cool. he only got hit once that fight. He landed like 100% of his shots yeah. in that fight. Yeah, it was beautiful. It's crazy, oh, and that's our style. I, I was a Counter Striker at first. That's when I started. I was always like, I wait for guys to come in. Yeah, here it is, right here. Yeah, I remember that. calling this, and I remember oh, telling shit. people because I was afraid. <laughs> I was a fan of Anderson's from look at that watching bounce. him fight I love in England. That look at that jab. Oh. I was a fan of watching him fight in England in Cage Rage and watching him fight in Pride. And I I remember saying this, ladies and gentlemen, this is a different kind of striker. Mm. Like this is this is one of the first times you got a high level. Look, look at the looks he's giving him as well. The shoulder feints and the lightness frames, of his feet, man. The bounce, lightness, that bounce. He's on. People forget, man. Look how good he is. Ping. He's already. He's over. Yeah. Ping. Boom, ping. Boom, boom. Look at that. Come uh, on, son. Wait for him to get up again. Yeah. And that ping, knee. Ping. 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 Shit. Ping. Ping. Just this is perfect. beautiful, bro. I mean, come on, man. Almost every shot boom, lands. He's boom, not getting hit. Boom. It's incredible. Ready? Doosh. Boom. And it's over. Insane. And Chris was a beast, man. He could a take beast. a shot. He could take it all the time. Oh. There was one with him, my, well, not Mike Easton. It was a guy. Rocked him. And he, as he's moving back, as he's hurt, and he drops the guy, knocks him out. Dude. Cold. Yeah, no. Chris could take a tremendous shot. Mm -hmm. He was he had unbelievable heart. But Anderson, I feel like in that, that's my argument for Anderson being the GOAT. Yeah. It's There's moments that he, he had. Oh, it's him and Fedor, right? Yeah. I saw his kid the other day after my fight. I didn't wreck it. I was like, in the elevator, I was like, you're Anderson's son. He's like, yeah. I was like, uh -huh. Baby goat. 